Welcome to the video lecture on periodic and aperiodic signals. In this video, we'll consider a discrete time signal x of n, which is a product of two sinusoidal signals, cosine of 1 by 3 pi into n and sine of 2n. So the task is to determine is this signal periodic or aperiodic? If periodic, what is the fundamental period? So to begin with, so I'll consider these two signals as two independent signals. So first I'll consider cosine of, I'll consider first cosine of 1 by 3 pi into n. So by comparing this with cos omega n, comparing this with the signal cos omega n, I can find its angular frequency omega, which is equal to 1 by 3 into pi. For, a, for such a signal, for a discrete time sinusoidal signal to be periodic, the condition is its angular frequency omega must be a rational multiple of 2 pi, 2 pi into m by n. We already know this. So, this omega, yes, I can arrange this as a rational multiple of 2 pi, something like this, which is still pi by 3. So, I say that the signal cos 1 by 3 into pi n is periodic. So now next I'll consider the signal second part sine 2n. So again comparing this with the standard signal sine omega n I can find omega as 2. So now again I have to arrange this as a rational multiple of 2 pi in this case which is not possible. Hence this signal is a periodic. And the product of these two is x of n. So in that first signal is periodic and second signal is aperiodic and the product of two signals which is periodic and aperiodic the resultant signal is non-periodic or we also call this as aperiodic signal. So the result is aperiodic signal.